Okay guys, today's video I'm going to show you how to remove a strip lug nut even so bad it's so bad that even those special uh, tools that they have that grip it and have the op and they dig into it is not going to take it off. All right, and I say this over and over again in all my videos that I do with the wheels and brakes: don't use an impact when tightening it. That's what happens; they over tighten them. Now, what happens if you're in the middle of, in a desert somewhere? All right, and you have no cell phone reception. All right, you get the idea. You're basically, you know. I don't want to use the word, all right? You always torque them. Bolts, these bolts are supposed to be torqued. If, you, if a tire guy is using an impact to put them on, use somebody else because most of those guys don't know what the hell they're doing. Anyway, um, to get this off when no, like I said, no, uh, no socket removal is going to work. It's going to just strip it out and make it worse. You're going to drill it out, okay? You're going to start with a thinner drill bit in there basically what I like to do is to start with a smaller one then the one that's on the drill then the next one up whatever you got a little bit bigger you just don't want to go over big but it's almost as big as the stud itself all right and you're gonna drill into it about an inch and a half enough that it passes uh, right near the rim okay now what that's gonna do is if you can imagine, you're going to drill out the hole bigger, bigger, and bigger. It's going to get really, really weak. So then when you put something on there, anything to grab it or hit, hit a socket on there, just enough, it's going to snap right off. And that's the goal. And now you're going to have to replace the stud that's in back of it. But basically, there's no other way to do it unless you have a torch and you want to burn it off. But if you have nice rims like these, you're going to ruin them. So the best way to do it is to drill it out. All right. I started... Um, I started with the uh, smaller one. I don't know what this is. It's maybe like 3 8 or something like that. And we're gonna go up and I'm gonna keep doing it and show you how it looks. Okay, so you spray some penetrating oil in there, There's some like uh, WD-40 or something in there. And the trick with the gun, with the uh, drill bit, all right, so keep a steady pressure. Don't cock it to the side, you don't wanna snap it. But don't go full, don't go all the way. You go, like this just enough and a nice even pressure sorry nice even pressure you don't want to go faster than that you're going to dull the blade now let the let the let the drill bit do the work all right then you stop and see how far you're in there all right so uh, it's about a half an inch we want to go about an inch we want to go past where the lug nut seats under the rim all right, so let me do that, get back to you. Okay, now that I drilled it, you see how much I drilled it in, how big it is? So now, we're just gonna put some kind of a socket hammer on there, and it should snap right off. Okay, let's see what it looks like. See how I drilled it in there? And I just made it snap right off. So now you just replace the stud, all because somebody had to over torque it, all right? and it didn't damage the rim. I just wanted to show you the nut. See how rounded off it is? Completely rounded off, there's nothing, there was nothing left of it. All right, I just wanna show you that part. That's the most important thing. And that's how you do it, guys. Motor car nut, please subscribe, hit the like button. Any questions, leave them below. I answer all my comments. Check out all my other videos on how to save uh, money. Do it yourself and do it right. Thanks, guys.